Hi guys, welcome back to Divine Times 2. Today I want to talk to you about and share with you a family homeschool planner. Now this planner is by Rebecca Scarlotta Ferris. I looked at other websites where I did see this planner, but they were sold out. So the only place that I was able to grab it was at Amazon.com. It does come with a wrap. And let me tell you, the picture on this planner is absolutely beautiful. For those of you who like to hear, wrappers okay let's see hope you can see this well okay here this book belongs to name address telephone cell phone okay this is an example of what your planner may look like All right, family memories. Okay, that also has a little calendar. Love that it has a calendar. With all the dates. Websites for, um, if you're using websites for your children to go on for, um, extra learning power oh okay this is cool this is a chart a daily chore chart okay there's four of them okay and you can cut them out cool okay this is teacher schedule your class plan. It also has subjects. Okay. Bible, math, history, science, language, arts, spelling, vocabulary, writing. Student schedule. Has more than one student schedule. Three. Four. Okay, so up to four students. Okay, I like the way that it has the calendar with the number the numbers on it. You could write anything in the boxes. Okay, I love that it has tidbits and information for you how to organize for school. Love that. Oh, it also has a shopping list. Okay, and you, you know what? You can tear this out and make copies of it too. Cool, nice. Okay, things to do around the house. So basically, now that I'm looking at it, basically, this is for every month. So you have around the house, monthly chores for kids, household needs and dreams, home thoughts. Okay, books. A list of enjoy reading okay what the students enjoy reading books to read read alouds going to the library and their due dates also fun learning like field trips cool love that okay. July Okay, now here, oh, here is to do this week, to do this week, and dinner menu, self-care, plan to, to care for yourself. Oh, like a day that you choose to, let's say, pamper yourself. Okay, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. I guess you circle the day and put, write down if you want, what 
pampering you're going to do for that day. Beautiful, colorful, bright pages. Love it. The rhythm of routine, okay? More info, tidbits um, that can help you with routines. Finding a, a weekly rhythm, a little play. Again, shopping lists. Make copies of it. Around the house. So basically, for every month, it repeats itself okay so every month you're organized oh, look at how beautiful this is and i love that it has all different flowers no flowers and it you know what it also has bible verses okay it also has bible verses and it also have it has bible verses on each day of the week so you can go to that and read it very cool oh, look at this that is just absolutely beautiful dealing with interruptions wow this book is like stunning October See if it has oh, December. Oh, let me see what it has for November. Oh, here for Chris a Christmas shopping list. You see? Christmas shopping list. Okay. And then the store gifts to purchase. So you can even put the name of the store and what you want to buy in that store for gift giving. Notes. That is so awesome. And here also, this is for the child gift idea, the budget. Oh, here it includes websites. Oh, amazon.com. I don't know if you can see that. Amazon.com right here. Okay, which you're buying on online, other websites. Cool. Let's see what they have for November. Oh, okay. One of my favorite months is November love the month of november oh events and party page right there events and party page date time the date the time location what you need to take like let's say if it's a potluck holiday plans even greeting cards why are you sending greeting cards to decorations decorating checklist Holiday hopes. What would you like your holiday to involve this year? Involve this year. Decorating shopping list, okay? Beautiful. All the little pictures. Christmas memories. So basically every month it's the same thing, okay? Of course, in December there's a little more, like the shopping list for Christmas gifts, okay, because it is December. Oh, okay, what else? Okay, semester success for each student. You also get an, an attendance record, okay? Right there, an attendance 
record. Okay, student's name each month. And I believe it probably has four, one for each child. Grade log, oh, even the grades, you can even add them. Progress and accomplishments. There's another attendance record right here. Okay, four students. Awesome. Rethinking resolutions. Love that it has info, it has tidbits. Love that. Wow, what a beautiful page. Okay, so all of this, so it starts, what, in Ju July? So it starts in July and it ends in June. So here it says another year. Okay, another year of homeschooling. Okay, has passed. So from July to June. Ooh, it even has an area for vacation plans. Oh, and, and report card. Look at how cute. Report card common, semester one, semester two. Okay, let's see. So this is student, teacher, academics. Semester one, two, and final. Attendance here. Grading scale, literature completed, enrichment and events. It's so cool. You can even take this out and fold it. Very nice. Okay, it ends with the report cards. Well planned start, parent assessment, student placement. Okay, more information. Manage homeschool in one in one planner. You know what? True. That's absolutely true. You can have all of it. Recipes, um, what you're making for dinner. Uh, gifts for Christmas, everything in just one place, your lesson plans, what you're going to do on that day, websites that you want your children to go to. This is amazing. Okay, and it even has everything that you need for homeschooling. It has a list right here. Okay, curriculum and budget for each student, monthly articles for homeschool moms. Okay, inspirational quotes and scripture. Okay, even home management. So this this planner is awesome. I am so glad I was able to purchase this because it's really amazing. And again, this is the first time um, I'm going to use a, a planner, a homeschool planner. Okay. Well, you know what? I, I'm, I hope you enjoyed this video and I love sharing this with you. Um, I know many of you will homeschool and you, ha you don't have a, uh, a planner to use. So I hope this helped you out just as it, had, it has helped me. So I hope you give us a thumbs up. Okay, and don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell notification button. Please comment down below. Um, let us know what you liked about it. Let us know what planner you are using. And remember that stay kind, positive, and divine. See you next time. Love you. Bye.